Hello, upcoming seventh graders. My name is Mr. Hart, and I will be your language arts teacher. Um, a little bit about me, guys. I've been teaching now for, this is my 12th year. Um, I taught my first six years over in Youngstown, and this is my sixth year here at Lordstown. I want you guys to know that I am super excited to be your teacher this year. My main goal as a language arts teacher is to get you guys excited about reading and writing. And I know, trust me, I've been doing this for a long time, I get it. The average seventh grader, a lot of you guys might have different opinions about reading and writing. Some of you guys might hate it, some of you guys might like it, or you, you might love it. I understand that. No matter where you are, my goal is by the end of this class for you guys to leave here with at least somewhat of a greater appreciation of reading or writing. Um, so I'm gonna give you guys kind of a quick little heads up of what this class is going to be like. Um, first things first, I will tell you guys that you guys are going to have me for a block period. That means by block, you're gonna have me two periods in a row, um, whether that be first and second period or third, third and fourth period. Um, I want you guys to know, um, if you guys have me for two, when you guys have me for two periods, uh, at the break, I will allow you guys to kind of, so in between first and second period, I will allow you guys to go either to the restroom or kind of at least, I don't know, stretch around a little bit. We will not be working straight for that entire hour and a half. Okay. Uh, some things that I do want you guys to know going into this class, I recommend everybody getting a binder, uh, just to store some of your guys' papers in. This year, I will tell you, I'm going to be trying to use Google Classroom a lot more throughout the year, uh, just to even do a little thing to help prevent the spread here. Um, we, I'm going to try to give you guys as few papers as possible, but at the same time, a binder will help you because from time to time, it will be inevitable that some things I am going to have printouts for. Um, what I do ask, guys, is in the next couple days, if everybody here can check their emails, I tried my best to go and I found everybody's email on the school website and I sent you guys an email inviting you guys to Google Classroom. If you don't do it by day one, that's fine. But if you could sign up for, or follow the email and sign up for Google Classroom, that would just save us time eventually for our first day. Uh, just so you guys can see, this is kind of what my classroom looks like. For some of you, this will be your home room if it's on your schedule. For others, you guys will begin and we'll have you third and fourth period. Uh, other things that I do want you guys to know, when you come into class every day, a big thing um, that I guess I, I do want you guys to be aware of is we're gonna start every day with everyone's favorite thing, bell work, um, which bell work for here, that's typically where we're gonna do our grammar, that type of stuff like commas, punctuation, you know, everybody's favorite thing about English class. After that, we're gonna go into either reading a wide variety of novels, short stories, um, we're going to have group activities. We're going to have games. We're going to do all the stuff that you guys hopefully have come to like about school. I'm definitely all about that. And we're going to try to keep that up this school year. So anyways, guys, I just want you all to know that I am super excited to meet you guys in a couple of days. I hope you all enjoy your last so many days of summer. And I'll see you soon. Take care.